Hi everyone, um, this is a short how-to tutorial on shadow lifting. This picture I shot about a couple days ago when it was raining in California here. The picture looks like it's very underexposed and it is. I shot it at ISO 200 at F5 handheld. So um, it does look like a really good picture. What we, we're going to do is we're going to recover the shadow uh, from this picture here. So first thing I'll do is I'll go down here and do my lens correction here to correct my lens and the vignetting that it's getting from this wide angle lens here. And then we're going to lift the shadow, see how much details we can get out of the shadow here. And then we're going to increase the exposure a little bit. Still want a little bit of a contrast in there. Increase the shadows in the black. A little bit of clarity in the clouds. You can see the clouds getting more clarity. A little bit more saturation. And the picture's looking good already. What I'm going to do is I'm going to change the hue of the sky. Make it look a little bit more blue. Darker blue. Maybe make the yellow here. This part here a little bit more yellow. And the grass a little bit more green. What I'm doing, I'm scrolling the mouse up to increase the saturation, the hue. And it's looking good already. Uh, the last thing we're going to do is we're going to do a little noise reduction here. I like to keep my details up so that I can keep the detail when I do my noise reduction. And a little bit of sharpening. And here we go. That was a really bad un underexposed uh, picture and we were able to recover the detail in the dark shadow areas um, using Lightroom. Um, the D600 has uh, great dynamic range and I've done it with the D7000 also. Um, hope this helped you guys when you guys are doing um, landscape photography. Thank you and bye.